the winter was over, we wake up to snow on April 13th. Ice is also building up on the roads all around the valley. It's a pretty nasty morning out there for this time of the year. It does make for dangerous driving if you don't slow it down and pay attention. The Valley Today's Brian Sherrod, he joins us live with a look at what you can expect when you head out the door. Good morning, Brian. Where are you? Well, good morning, Jordan and Lisa, and we made our way to Broadway this time. We were showing you around 45th Street earlier and 13th Avenue as well, but we want to definitely show you more of this road. So as we back up and definitely show you, this road is more wet than any of the road, but all because it's wet doesn't mean it's not slippery. So we want to show you that the snow has melted on the Broadway area, but you still want to be cautious on this road because again, it is slippery. And what we can tell you with some good news is we only saw one minor accident all morning. So that's a good news right there when it comes to traveling on these roads. But what we want to mention is you still want to be cautious on the way to work and on the way to school as well. Because again, there are many more impacted areas in downtown as we just showed you earlier with the last hour of the where we were. Now we want to also mention Excuse me. We want to mention that you want to make sure you're being cautious on the sidewalk as well. Sidewalks are slippery. So as you're getting out to walk into school or walk into work, just make sure you're just being cautious where you're stepping because the worst thing you want to do is fall on a sidewalk because you're not paying attention. So again, just be cautious this morning. And I was looking, it's 26 degrees, so it's like, oh, it looks pretty nice so, out there right now. But it's it's cold and yeah, it's icy. That is well below freezing, too. And uh, downtown there can be a little uh, protected from the wind. That would maybe blow things around as well. Get outside of the city a bit more. Right. And that is another thing to take into consideration. Brian Sherrod reporting live, keeping us updated. Thank you. Let's